morning. This is David at Stoneyard.com. We're in Littleton, Mass. We're in our showroom. And guess what? We're doing the columns. So what we've done is we've designed the columns so they're big enough. They're about 20 by 20 so that we can put a corner piece, another corner piece, and a stone in the middle. We've set the corners of both of these columns, these two columns, and this is we, what we used was Boston Blend Square and Rec. So let me just point to the board here. So this is Boston Blend Square and Rec. Notice there's you know grays, there's darker colors, beigey, gray colors. So there's a mixture of about eight different colored stones. So when we do this column, we want to try to represent all of these stones in this color. Okay, so we have our corners. This is a whole pallet. We need about 40 feet of corners to do that job inside. So we carefully selected out the corners. And you'll notice that a corner may look like this. We may have to trim some on the bottom, not much on this one. But you see the way this top kind of slopes up? We're gonna have to trim that. And we'll do that with the grinder or the tile saw so that, you know, the objective is for, I got a long side and a short side. Now, I wanna to try to have that short side merge in with the long side. This particular side is even with this, so what we'll end up doing is trimming that back. But again, you see how this is kind of sloping that way? We want this stone to be set like this, so we'll trim a little bit here to accomplish that. But, the other point that I want you guys to see is, look at all these stones we rejected. You know, partly for color, partly for irregular surfaces. Not that we couldn't have used this on some jobs, but when it's an inside job, you want it to look just so. So you want to get 20, 30% extra material. We also have brought in the flats. So what we're doing is, we're coloring out the flats, we're trying to get the colors and the shapes that we want. We got a few pieces that we've rejected. So when you're doing a project, an inside project, you want to be very selective. So get lots of extra materials and then you know do the layout. And then once everything is just so, then we're gonna put them up. But part of putting them up is we're gonna to have to take and trim up some stones. So notice we've got a mark here for one of the inside stones and a mark here. We're gonna put this up, use the hammer, trim this, trim this over here. And then now this is ready to install. All right, thank you so much. This is David at stoneyard.com.